nostalgia for Mars. Hello, all you Martians out there. It's your turn, fix foot, soul, a bit of that old world flavor. You're tuned to Radio Nostalgia from Mars. Breathe easy, kick back, and reminisce. Take my hand, explaining me. shouldn't be sad when we think of the road ahead take my hand don't let go I know we won't we won't get lost oh no take my hand Don't let go The signs are fake And the maps are false But we must Go From Mars. Wow, what a way to start the show. Anna Chuchin with Take My Hand, her sublime take on our wonderful project called Humanity. Beautiful. Plenty more to come into Soul Show. 
our show packed with stories and music to remind ourselves of where we are and how far we've come. Our first caller for the show calls it like it is and was a hard-hitting look back at the last days on Earth from the perspective of a shrewd businessman and loving father. Stories, memories, the good old days. Original sources, authentic tales, hope, inspiration, drama. Bringing nostalgia from Mars. I worked in oil, brokering gasoline to be exact. It's a strange business, uh, probably not like you would actually imagine it to be. My day started something like this. I check Reuters and my sheets. See if there's been a change in the fundamentals. See if the spread's up or down. And then when the clock strikes go, I'm on the phone. I could be calling some commercial shop in Bumble, Kansas, where little old Sue loves to know how my daughter's doing. Or I could be trying to get into the head of a powerful Russian who knows the world wants his phone number. That's when the psychology kicks in, and I go to work. If they pick up the phone, they're mine. That's the game. I started when I was uh, 29, 30. <laughs> my boss. My boss was a coked up, permatanned moron who was wasted by lunch. More money than sense. Screaming at waiters, because, uh, I don't know. You don't drink gin out of a glass like that. And Caesar salad is supposed to have eight pieces. Eight pieces of chicken, you stunted fool. Stunted fool was his favorite insult. It's coming from a guy who was five foot nothing. That was pretty much my life, 24 seven. I traveled a lot, meeting clients all over the world. The Amazon, the Gulf, Siberia, Central Asia, the States, Singapore, everywhere. Looking back, I can't claim that I ever would recommend that life, nor can I claim that I was ever really happy doing it. But it was fun. I mean, talk about your share of moments. There was this one girl, some strange mix of Algiers and Paris, with some sprinkle of Havana, a dancer, naturally. Was so pretty. She'd turn a priest's head or give a nun a Sometimes I wonder what happened to her. But we all had the same feeling. This can't last. And sure enough, we were right. First, you couldn't drink the water. Then you couldn't eat the crops. And pretty soon, we wouldn't be able to breathe the air. I remember looking at Amy and wondering what kind of a future would she have. So I decided to do something about it. The Mars project was plan B for planet Earth, which was most evidently f The family and I had already put down roots in Tesla City by the time the great catastrophe really hit. The corporation knew my contacts in the world of drilling and refining would be useful, so I adapted my skills to something more practical. Now we are all that keeps this little planet running. Mining those Martian chemicals for the battery banks, Martian cement for the buildings. My pure little Emma has a future. When somebody sits down and writes this all up for the history books, it might just be men like me they'll be hailing as heroes. It's men like me who saved humanity. Men like me who took us further than we ever dreamt possible. Radio nostalgia from Mars. Oh, some pretty heavy stuff. Reminds us that all kinds made it up here to Mars. But we're all in it together now and remain creatures of the world. You're tight beam to Radio Nostalgia from Mars. Music for the lost days of Earth. Children. 
Tractor takes us back. Stefan Milenkovic pining for blue skies, house musing on the games we play. Just a reminder that until further notice, there is a moratorium on all team leaders playing card and board games with their teams, following an incident over a game of Monopoly in Section C. All senior Section team leaders will convene for emergency counseling and anger management courses. Until then, there will be no intersectional board game tournaments and no games with groups larger than four people at a time per team. In the interim, teams are encouraged to take advantage of the half ration special on Omas, the delicious and relaxing drink that takes the edge off of everything. Our next caller, Yamil, takes us into her world of food, smells, sensuality, blue skies, and sings us a personal song to remember. Histoire. Mémoire, le bon vieux temps, source originale, fable authentique, espoir, inspiration, drame, musique, radio nostalgie de Mars. I have nightmares. I'm happy to be alive, but I knew many who deserved to live more than I did. But this is a radio program about nostalgia, not guilt. I've been nostalgic since I was 20, when I left Havana. In Europe, I felt different. Each country has a smell. Mars doesn't. Where I come from, the smell of the ocean, mango, bananas, coconut, Mama's food, ropa vieja de la abuelita, el con gris, la yuca con mojito, the most beautiful sun of Malecón, the smell of my street when the rain falls, all of that make me into the person I am. So when I left, I grew stronger. I experienced the world, but forever stayed incomplete. So now I'm double nostalgic. 
We were full of life, laughing on warm nights under blue sky, touching each other. The air filled with the smell of sweat from dancing with a orchestra Aragon playing from an apartment. Now, the only way I can feel this is... <laughs> ¿Cómo fue? No sé decirte cómo fue. No sé explicarme qué pasó, pero de ti 
Me enamoré. Fue una luz que iluminó todo mi ser. Tu risa como manantial llenó mi vida de inquietud. Fueron tus ojos o oh, tu boca, fueron tus manos o oh, tu voz. Fue a lo mejor la impaciencia de tanto esperar tu llegada, más no sé, no sé decirte cómo fue. No sé explicarme qué pasó, pero de ti me enamoré. Слушайте Radio Nostalgia за Mars. Thank you, Yamil. What a wonderful story. Reminds us that life is about so much more than just base survival. Well, living in space has always been challenging. And here's a song that pokes a little fun at living in cramped quarters. Needs no introduction. Argue all you want. It's a classic. Take a moment, relax, and remember with Radio Nostalgia from Mars. A Russian and an American work together in space. A very different sight from the Cold War arms race, where the Kubrick or Tarkovsky, Solaris or 2001, Melville or Dostoevsky, you sing with all your London Jew astronauts, argued about art, values and international relations to astronauts. Stalin and your talent to suffer under Zars, my friend. Your history is long. You also inflict the scars. Two astronauts argued about art. That is an international relations. Two astronauts. <laughs> 